Hey, what's going on guys? This is Woody Geek. This is the next part in our Super Mario RPG walkthrough. Now, I want to show you something really cool. Well, not really cool, because I'm not really a fan of the series. But look at this. Oh my god, what is that? Who is that? What is this? Oh my god, it's like Link and I'm jumping on his head. I'm such a... Talking to him will only trigger the, uh... Did it did it did it ding You got the secret sound in Legend of Zelda. But yeah, it's freaking Link. There's also a cameo made by Samus later, but uh that's for later. Here's the pipe vault, which uh I guess you can go down into to get to the Yoster Isle, but I'm not going down there because it's it's just a place for I guess minor experience and the Yoster Isle isn't really that all that good. For me at least. Um But yeah. You can get a little bit of experience down there, and you can also get the Oster Island. The Oster Isle is not even required. Hey, Bowser, what's up? You seem to be lacking on some lackeys. Really? Ha! Biggest. Now watch how Bowser leaves. If Mario knows, then our reputation will be ruined. I'm right there! I could hear him! Oh my god. Anyway. Yeah, we're in Moleville. Place infested by is, oh my god, moles. Never would have saw, seen that coming. Uh, buying here, we get the punch glove for Mario and the symbols for Mallow. Here's a finger shot you can buy for 50 coins, but see, I already got it. Uh, mega shirt, mega pants, and work pants. Mid mushroom, I'll buy three of those, and two maples. Three. Okay. Let's equip the punch glove, baby. Symbols, the mega shirt, mega pants, and the work pants for Gino. I didn't want to buy the, um, mega cape, because if I got the work pants instead, it would raise everything of Gino's by about ten points. Ten points for the first three, and five for the other. For the last one, special defense. Uh, so yeah, I wanted to get that for Gino. Oh wait. Uh, cell weapons. Goodbye, Frog Fuchsius. Frog Fuchsius is memento. It's gone. So yeah, if you don't do that little thing with the giving of the cricket pie to Frog Fuchsius, Mallow's. This is first. Mallow's first equipped. Which is actually kind of sad. Going up here, you can see some mole, some female moles trying to get into the mine. So apparently, these two kids, Dinah and Might, yes, that's their names, have been trapped in the mines. And um, yeah, everyone's trying to get them out. Gotta love their southerner accents. You didn't even look over here, you jerk. A lunch jerk. Heck, Goomba's uncle. You're not a Goomba's uncle. It's just awesome how you can just jump on the uh, NPCs in this game. Here we have some new enemies. Here's the bob a Sparky, and a Magmite. The Magmites are actually kind of defensive, so you might want to hit them with some special attacks. These things, look, the Sparkies, take a lot of damage from physical hits. And for some reason, they give you a defense up, so don't know why. There's a timing on Mario's punch glove. It's the same as if he doesn't have any equips on. He can just punch. The Magmites have low special defense, so hit them with his mint. Uh, like, just hit them at all. And bombs can explode. There's a boss later in the mines that you can uh, that you fight, and he uses the bombs in his uh, team. But yeah, fighting these guys does actually give you a bit of experience, and it's it's good to do because. You know, with the Sparkies taking a lot of damage from physical hits, and Gino's are, and Gino has a lot of um, physical attack, uh, also, as well as um, the Gino Beam being just doing 60 damage fully powered. Uh, then yeah, it's actually really good to do. Magma over here, Toad over here. That Toad, uh, I guess, is kinda useful for later. Not really. Die, Sparky. Yeah, if you don't get the t if you just get a normal timed hit on the Sparkies, then they, uh, don't really... 
then they don't really get knocked out with me now first. So take care of him. Deaded. And oh, okay, never maybe not yet. Wow, really? More times than not when the bob bombs are not even um like if they're just attacked once or twice, then they uh get then they blow up. Uh is there an answer path here? No, I can't. Just wondering. Alright, jumping on the spring, you'd think he'd lead, lead you out, but no. Just makes Mario dizzy. And, this actually triggers a cutscene, a needed cutscene. Since when did he become a Brook? Uh, since when was he from Brooklyn? Oh, oh. So yeah, we have to chase Croco. Now we need this cutscene to happen. Because you can't progress further into the mine without bombs. And guess who has bombs? Croco. You can't grab up a bomb, that won't work, so you have to keep following him. Bombs? And crooks? Let me fight a couple of magmites or something. Oh god, these guys, the clusters. Hitting them with any physical attacks, I think, will cause them to do their special attack called Migraine. Which will, um... One hit kill anyone that uh, does it. Like anyone who hits him with a physical attack, it the mat the I think it's physical. Migraine will one hit kill them. Psych. Oh well, I was wrong. Apparent. No, that or um. Wow, they missed Gino. Um. I must have gotten it wrong, but I know they can do migraine too, so they can explode either way. Uh, but you know, after, um, what? Never mind. I was gonna say something that, um, usually happens when they do migraine. They would, uh, one hit kill anybody. But if you block them, you can ha hang on with one HP. Um, what's wrong, enemy? Um, but if you don't... Then you get one hit killed. So I don't know what happened there. I thought Gino would ha would have had a uh, one HP left. I guess not. Um, yeah. Hey, 69. Dead. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Let's f follow Croco. It's good to not follow him because you got these crooks here. And with Gino being faster than them, you can knock one out. And then if the other two run away. Then you just get 10 coins, 5 experience, and a uh, flower tab. You actually get flower tabs for beating each one of them. Okay, 4 experience. Let's drop a... Oh, wow. Um, let's drop a mushroom. And let me actually use a flower tab. Here's another one. Dead. And he's attacking, that means we can kill him. Die! And Gina level up. Alright, I guess that'll do for uh, this part of Super Mario RPG. Uh. Yeah. So, hopefully, you enjoyed this. What a geek, I'll see you guys later. I'm out.